my phone's gonna fall. <laughs> okay, it's good for now. It's good for now. Okay, so I wanted to talk to you guys about something that was on my heart, and it has to do with marriage. What what is that from? Marriage. I don't know. Well, Hawaii is the only one in the video. You want to be in the video too? Okay, Boo, you could be in I the video too. I thought I was too. going to be. Okay, yeah, you can chime in. Sorry, I didn't know you were in the video. Okay. Something that was on my heart lately is that a lot of unmarried girls have lists that they want their man to be, you know. I want him to be a hard worker. I want him to be a prayer warrior. I want him to be like listed. Name it. Think of it of a godly trait that you want your future husband to be. Then I see things online. Girls saying things like, you're so worried about the list that you're not worried about becoming the list for that person. Which in a way is true. Like, yeah, you should become a truthful person a prayer warrior, a hard worker, a loving person, slow to anger, all of that for your future husband. But I still feel like that mindset of, well, I need to become all of these great things for my future husband is a really self-centered mindset of Christianity. Like we are not Christians to become wives. We are Christians to serve God because what happens if you never get married or what happens if my husband dies in a car accident and I'm not a wife anymore? Am I, am I not useful? Is my godly character void? Is it, is it not necessary anymore? No. So I wanted to encourage you to tell yourself, I want to become all of these amazing godly things, not for the sake of becoming a good wife but for the sake of honoring Christ with my life. Christ has to be the reason we do everything. Look at your list of what you want your husband to be, all of the godly traits, all of the godly characters, and then apply them to yourself, but not for the sake of being a wife. Say, I want to be an honest person. I want to be a gracious person. I want to be slow to anger. I want to be have a servant's heart. I want to be easy to, for, uh, to forgive people. And all of these great qualities because I want to honor the Lord. And if I become a good wife because of it, bonus. You get what I'm saying? What do you think about what I'm saying? That it's good. But yeah, so become a godly person for God to be obedient because you want to be like Christ. And then if it's for others, that's awesome. That's a bonus. I don't want to take him for... (laughs) All right, I'm going to go inside with him. Bye, y'all.